Good day, our brothers and sisters, may the sun warm your heart with love. May any clouds that appear, instantly disappear. Blessings to you for a good day and the whole week through. A blessing that will make you smile this day. Smile instead of cry. May the day be full of laughter. Laugh away the sad. Look at the bright side, not the bad. Bless your day. Gisela Cardia has just received the message from Blessed Mother about the punishment of God to humans in the coming tragedy at the end of June when these people will have to be punished and suffer from the pain of their sins. We want to share with all of you about that message in this video today. Let's listen carefully and think about ourselves, and whether or not we will be punished. To ensure that as many people as possible see this video, kindly take a moment to share this video and subscribe to this channel. May this message touch your heart and help to bring you close to the conversation of souls and the conversion of sinners. If you believe so, please type Amen. A breath of prayer in the morning means a day of blessing sure, a breath of prayer in the evening means a night of rest secure. Our brothers and sisters, praying plays an important role in our daily life, therefore, let's join us and say together, Jesus, I believe you are the Son of God, that you died on the cross to rescue me from sin and death and to restore me to the Father. I choose now to turn from my sins, my self-centeredness, and every part of my life that does not please you. I choose you. I give myself to you. I receive your forgiveness and ask you to take your rightful place in my life as my Savior and Lord. Come reign in my heart, fill me with your love and your life, and help me become a truly loving person like you. Restore me, Jesus. Live in me. Love through me. Thank you, God. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Lord Jesus Christ, take all my freedom, my memory, my understanding, and my will. All that I have and cherish you have given me. I surrender it all to be guided by your will. Your grace and your love are wealth enough for me. Give me these, Lord Jesus, and I ask for nothing more. Amen. Blessed Mother appeared and warned Gisela Cardia about the punishment of God to humans, this punishment will come soon. The urgent warning from Blessed Mother made Gisela Cardia shiver and fear the future of humans. There will be more than 100,000 people who will be punished by God and whether or not we are in them. The answer will be shared with all of you right now. Beloved children of my Immaculate Heart, Receive the blessing of this mother who loves you. Come to me so that I may lead you to my divine Son Jesus Christ. You all are aware of the good deeds and wicked deeds you have committed. I'm urging you to turn from your sin right away since continuing to do so will only make you more prone to confusion and wickedness. At this most vulnerable period for humanity, my son's people must allow themselves to be set free from the shackles of sin. The people of my son are suffering mutilation in this conflict between good and evil. As a result, my divine son endures constant suffering from his children's lack of spiritual defense. They move on, to be sure, but in the direction of terror and horror. Beloved people of my heart, at the end of this month or the beginning of next month, 100,000 people will be punished by God because of their sins. Humans have so much of sins, however, they do not repent of their sins and continue making sins every day. Therefore, God will punish them to convert them. Beloved children of my heart, if you have this sign at night, you are the one that receives the punishment from God. If you have this sign in your body for a long period, you must be careful because it will drive you to death and create many dangers for your family. This sign usually appears at night when people prepare to sleep. 
Imagine lying in bed, tired and ready for sleep, but as minutes turn into hours, sleep continues to elude you. Your mind feels active, racing with thoughts, worries, or anxieties that seem to intensify in the stillness of the night. The more you try to relax and drift off, the more elusive sleep becomes. You may find yourself tossing and turning, shifting from one position to another, trying to find a comfortable spot. Your body feels restless, and despite feeling physically exhausted, your mind remains alert, making it difficult to transition into a relaxed state. As time passes, frustration and a sense of helplessness may start to build. Thoughts about the consequences of sleep deprivation, such as fatigue, reduced concentration, or the challenges of the day ahead, may add to your worries, further intensifying the difficulty of falling asleep. The silence of the night may amplify small sounds or sensations, making them seem louder or more noticeable than they usually would. Even the ticking of a clock or the hum of a distant noise can become sources of distraction that keep you awake. People with this disease will experience multiple awakenings throughout the night. They may wake up too early and find it difficult to resume sleep, leading to fragmented and disrupted sleep patterns. Day by day, people suffering from this disease will have mental health problems such as anxiety disorders, depression, and mood disorders. Beloved people of my heart, if you have this sign when you sleep at night, don't be scared and worried so much. God will forgive you and protect you when you repent your sins and pray every day. Having help from others also is another way for you to escape this disease. You can meet the doctor to have a suitable treatment. When humans have unity, everything will be better and God will protect you. You are not alone. Pray with your heart and our sacred hearts will protect you at all times. Be creatures of adoration, be creatures of hope in the promises that you have received. I bless you, my children, I cover you with my maternal mantle. Mother Mary Proverbs 3 verse 24 When you lie down, you will not be afraid, when you lie down, your sleep will be sweet. This verse speaks of the benefits of wisdom and following God's ways. If you have that sign, you must listen carefully to the warning of Blessed Mother. And now, let's join us and pray together. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee, blessed art thou among women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Behold the handmaid of the Lord, be it done unto me according to thy word. Thank you for watching till the end of our video. Our brothers and sisters, without fear and with more faith than in the past, let us continue in faith. Stay blessed and continue to pray for God to show all of us his graces and blessings. God bless us and protect us. Amen.